color one, which is Sukta. Works for many cars, but not for all of them. So that we want to show you the limit of each color. If you want to try now with a sample of Sukta and compare with the cast, you can. Some application obviously will not see the difference because both works for the others. And after that, we will now make a presentation on the micro tool. Micro tool is Windows, but Windows printable one, eh? micro perforated film. So you will see. We will also show you with laminate and without laminate. This is a cast. Is this is polymeric subtac? Yes. Um, and I show you yesterday the difference between uh, the temperatures um, uh, when the material is shrinking back or you make a post heating and it will stay in, in the new form, like the crease or whatever. Now we have um, um, the question even outside was, uh, can I change the material to, to make a wrap? Uh, the Swiss guy asked me, okay, this was uh, a cast one, but yes, you can switch because there are cars like the one over there, it's not so difficult, there are not very deep creases or something like this. Um, so you can use even uh, 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 you can use a calendar material, it's no problem. It's uh, not so easy to use because there's no structure in the glue. Uh, you need another technique. Uh, I think everyone here has read before without Hexpress or something. Uh, knows the old technique, it's complicated and it takes a little bit of time, so you have to think about um, is it really a fortune um, uh, to, to uh, an advantage to, to wrap with a cheaper material uh, when I need much more time to wrap it at one point. The other point is um, um, yes, you can make flat surfaces and so on, but when you have uh, uh, deep points like this. Uh, and you form it in, uh, you cannot post heat it. Post heating is only working with cast materials. So when you have something like this, um, you have to cut it away. Make a cut and make an inlay and, and, and so on to, to, to make a, a, a wrap with it. Um, that's how car wrapping is uh, starting years before, maybe 15 years or whatever. Uh, we all mostly use uh, our calendar materials because there's nothing else and we have to cut and cut and cut and cut and uh, make inlays and, and so on. It's a lot of work and it looks sometimes awful because of the overlapping and so on. Uh, but uh, it's possible, yes. Uh, to show uh, the difference between the cast and but I'm not like a or whatever. You can make the same test yesterday. Do you remember? It's the same. When you want to stretch, when you, when you want to stretch the material, uh, you have to heat it up to 40 degrees. Nearly 40 degrees. You can transform it. So, the effect is the same. Stick it on, the heat is going on, coming back. Do you remember this original size? It's coming back. So, when I heat a point over 80 degrees, uh, which is uh, the post heat temperature for cast materials, same as yesterday. Like this, 89 degrees. And then, heat it again. It will not come back completely, but you see the difference, it will come back parts. The cast one will stay completely in this, and this one will come back a little bit. Maybe the halfway will come back. When I post heat it, there, are, there is a rest 
of uh, a, a minimum of, of uh, uh, memory effect, and it will, over the time, pop off out of the creases. And that's the main reason why we don't uh, use uh, color and material. <laughs> Not coming back completely, but halfway, maybe something like this. And that's enough to let it go off. All of this is that's the problem. So you have to cut this thing away, make an extra part to, to uh, stick it in, or something like this. Um, yes, that's the main difference. So the answer. When you ask me, can I uh, spare money, save money when I use a cheaper material? Yes, you can. You can use a cheaper material, but you have to uh, pay money with your time when you're working with it. Because every cut needs time, every inlay needs time. Um, the wrap is made real, uh, fast in, in a few hours, but it needs time to cut all the edges and fix it and, and finish it. Um, so it's your choice, uh, which one you want to use. Okay, I'm ready. Now I think it, from your side, if you want to try, you know, polymeric so the process is calendar. That's why you have memory, because on the calendar you take the uh, liquid with pigments, uh, plasticizers, you put in a beam, mix everything, and then you have two rolls and they calendar the film. So because you make this first on the process, on production process, you made memory. That's why whatever you have on calendar film, you will always have memory. On the cast, it's not. You have seen the process. You take your plasticizers, you take your pigment, you put it inside, and you apply it on the liner. There's no pressure, there's no tension on it. So there's no memory on the, on the film. So whatever you do, that's why when you apply on a car, if you have 3D, but there is no memory. That's the difference. But now, if you want to try both, great. Just to see the difference. For some cars, you can apply obviously primary calendar. For some others, you will require custom. Okay. Any question? And again, if you want to try to see the difference between both, you have a sample here. So try. Maybe one thing. Um, there are products on the market uh, which were calendared. You can wrap a car with. Um, it is possible, yes. Um, uh, this uh, produces um, uh, solve the problem with a strong loop to fix it in the deep creases. But remember, when you have to uh, remove the vinyl after a year or a month, whatever, <laughs> forget it. No way. You have when you make a car wrap, you have to use uh, must use a material which is completely removable with its glue on the vinyl and not on the surface, okay? Okay, now uh, we will see uh, Michael Buff